Alrighty guys, hopefully you're having a cream cheese all type of day, which doesn't make sense, but that is okay. Okay, so Call of Duty. I was planning on making a new video because I've been recycling my old footage quite a bit. And yesterday I uploaded another recycled footage. It's just, I, I got tired of lying and I feel like I complain too much, but I'm just in general tired of the game. I I don't have any love for it anymore. And I'm, I'm considering quitting until Modern Warfare 2 game is broken and then the World War II setting just turns so many people off. It's and then Cold War it just sucked and Modern Warfare was the last game I enjoyed and they completely butchered it, man. Like they had a new fan base in the palm of their hand. Okay, all you had to do was just quit the yearly releases and they just slapped you around the face. <laughs> like I understand that they're forced to put a game out. It's just, it's annoying me as a consumer of the product. And I also understand that they were gone for two weeks and that's why Warzone is so broken and they're just now updating it. Like today or it's tomorrow, one of these days, they're updating it. I don't want to come off petty, but in my opinion, it's kind of too late for me. I just, I lost all interest in Caldera. I lost all interest in Call of Duty. I, I haven't been playing Call of Duty really anymore. It brings me in a rough predicament because I pretty much discussed all the reasons why I'm burned out on Call of Duty and this is kind of just a straight up rant to be honest. The foliage on the Warzone map, just the Warzone map it doesn't feel different at all. The loadout jobs not coming in instantly and how they changed the rule set of that, which that was the main reason why people played Warzone is to get their loadouts. So you would assume that they wouldn't take away the biggest thing that made people play, but I guess not. You could have just increased the price or something. I don't know. The game released the beginning of November and it is now January 11th. And we're just now getting the atomic camo fixed. Just now. It, it's crazy to me, man. <laughs> I, I stopped grinding for it because the weapon levels are just so incredibly high that I just, I couldn't do it anymore. I got one gold gun in four days. I, I'm like, nah. I mean, maybe I could get it in one day if I really put it in, but I don't even know about that. Like, it, it's just, it took way too long to get one golden gun. And after that, I'm kind of like, nah. World War II setting, a lot of people don't like. Personally, I don't feel like setting makes or breaks a COD. I feel like COD makes or breaks a COD, and Call of Duty shoots itself in the foot far too often. Um, then that brings me to Cold War. I did play Cold War for a little bit. I was going to get Ninja Diffuse on all three games and kind of get that going, you know, because I really, I really, really, really want to move on from Modern Warfare Search and Destroy and become Vanguard Ninja, you know. For Modern Warfare, I got Damascus. I got Obsidian, you know. I got numerous ninja diffuses. Actually, um, I keep on hinting at a big video in the description of my last few videos. And what that big video is, is I'm, this might be my um, final Call of Duty video. And if I do continue making Call of Duty videos after this video that um, I'm releasing, then it's going to be way less common until Modern Warfare 2 comes out. I still want to make content. But it's not going to be Call of Duty content, which I don't know how that's going to work. I don't even have a plan for tomorrow, if I'm being honest. I, I'm just going to have to roll with it, man, because I am i don't have motivation to play this game anymore. It may be a point of just burnout, you know, tired of the annual releases. Um, I mean, honestly, if we think about it, I feel like Cold War, if they continue supporting Modern Warfare, you could have had Cold War and Modern Warfare and then Warzone, you know, you had that Warzone for like the big stakes games. You have Modern Warfare for mostly just the search and show. And then you have Cold War for the fast paced gameplay, you know, that people love. But then they kind of screwed it all over. And I don't have a list here and I should have made a list. But there's just so much going on with Call of Duty right now that if you played it, then you would know. I just lost my patience with the game. I don't feel love for the Call of Duty games. I I'm just waiting for Modern Warfare 2, part two. Modern Warfare 2, too. That's just kind of the state I'm at. I, I feel like I'm coming off very 
spontaneous because I am I really should have wrote this down so you kind of just got petty ran out of the way just the gist that I wanted to get at is the game infuriates me more than makes me happy I don't have fun with Call of Duty anymore and that's the state I'm at I mean if you enjoy it you enjoy it. if you like Caldera you like Caldera Rebirth I think Rebirth's all right you know it has this good and bad moments it's completely your choice in my eyes the game is dead <laughs> and they killed it uh, the yearly releases killed it for me. I, I get tired of having to stop supporting one game besides stupid store bundles because of another game, you know, and how you just expect everyone to just migrate over. Modern Warfare Roman numeral 2, whatever. It is my last draw. For me personally, if that game is not good, I, I, I think I'm done with the franchise in general. It, it legit all relies on that game. So I hope it's amazing. I really do. It's just... I'm kind of skeptical for the way that this franchise is headed. There are some positives with how they got rid of loot boxes and all this stuff, but yearly releases and then what they're doing to their employees and Bobby Kodak and all this stuff, you know, it's just... Even inside, I, I haven't been paying for any bundles because um, I don't want to support the game. Activision needs some serious change. Call of Duty needs some serious change. Okay, that that's that's why I'm gonna have to leave it at. I just don't know where I'm going with it now. Um, here's the thing: is that I made another 40-minute version of this. It's just the audio didn't come out good, so I hope this comes out better than my last audio because that that was unfortunate. I legit recorded for 36 minutes. I said 40, but it was actually 36. Close enough. That, that kind of leaves to the point of the future of the channel. Um, I have 116 subscribers now. Uh, thank you so much. I do notice that my video quality has kind of went downhill because I was getting used to my computer and then I was recycling footage. Um, on that texting video, which did better than my rehash of things. That video I legit spent four hours on, so I, I hope you enjoyed. That's actually one of my favorite videos because it's legit not me talking about Call of Duty. It's me talking about me, you know, just what, what I was thinking about, and it was just super fun to make, you know, just my favorite videos are the ones where I just get to be me, and I'm always me. I'm a, I'm a very unique person. I would say, I mean, don't quote me on that, but I try to be unique. Um, yeah. So what's next for my channel? Uh, first of all, I'm getting a new desk. So I, I right now I'm completely re wanting to completely reset what my room looks like. Uh, I want to get rid of the y ugly yellow light that I have. Get like a better, probably white light. Something like that, you know, something that looks better in general. Just just something that makes the room look better. Maybe get some sunlight in here in general. That could probably help. But usually when I make these videos, like right now, it's at like 10 o'clock at night. So I like go to school, come home for a little bit, lack motivation to get on. And then I get on and I rant. So also I'm getting LEDs, like a bit of LEDs. Getting that set up, I got some lights, and I'm planning on getting a new webcam. It's just, it's just I, I want my visual side to look better, so when I get that stuff set up, I don't even have the desk yet. When I get that stuff set up, I want it to pay off. I, I It's probably not going to be perfect at first, but I, I, I just want to change my channel. And sorry, I need to turn on the notifications off. I'm so sorry. Which I still want to upload daily, which... I, I, once again, I don't know what I'm going to upload tomorrow because I want to upload daily, but I, I'm not playing Call of Duty. I'll probably play Call of Duty, just not for videos because I don't have much passion behind the videos anymore. Besides when I'm getting mad and I'm tired of getting mad about Call of Duty. It's, it shouldn't be that big of a deal to me. And once I realized that I was, when I play Call of Duty, I'm not happy. I'm, I'm mad because I suck, probably. You could say that. You could say, get good, kid. But even if I do get good, skill-based matchmaking means other people are getting good with me getting good. And then I will always think I'm bad because I'm playing with the get good kids. You know? 
another thing, I've been working on music mostly, in case you're wondering what I'm kind of doing in the background, because I'm not gaming much in general anymore. I, yeah, most of my stuff, most of my time has go, gone into watching YouTube, watching tutorials, you know, potentially getting a PC set up, um, just that kind of stuff, just kind of, you know, looking for the future. I have three semesters left before I'm out of high school. It is kind of scary because I've always, I've, I always wanted to be something. I wanted to do something that I like doing. So I, I try pouring my heart into something to make it entertaining in a way. Um, and I, I did put a lot of heart into the texting video, but I didn't put a lot of heart into the other videos I've been releasing daily, just like spectating. You know it's lazy when you're spectating. I mean, no disrespect to Jeb and Tim because it's highly entertaining, but you know, it's so easy to just spectate. Um, respect, respect to them though. Um, they're some of my biggest um, influences on um, gaming. I feel like more passion has been dipped into the music side. I, I've been wanting to create music. It's, it's, I've talked about this before. Um, oops, sorry. I talked about this before. For me, music is something that I like listen to a beat. I get super amped about the beat. I write full entire songs to the beat. I'm just all over a beat. And I never actually sing it because my voice, it doesn't sound the way I want it to. Obviously, it's a little weird. I have a weird voice, um, in my opinion. Obviously, your own, you're your own biggest critic. But yeah, I'm just, I've been focusing on music, just overall general setup. And I don't know where I'm going with this, man. It's 10 o'clock and I've been doing this since the start of 9 o'clock, just talking to myself. I might edit this down and release this tomorrow. Expect possibly my final Call of Duty video. Until Modern Warfare 2, I might be releasing one last um, unlisted video. Just one that, it was my third video I ever made. I hope you guys understand, it's just trying to upload daily and trying to stay consistent. Basically trying to treat it like it's a necessity and not, you know, I, I, I'm determined to upload every single day. This is kind of just going all over the place, so I, I might scrap this. I'm just all over the place, man. I don't know.